It's Tuesday morning. I need to think about what day it was. It's a good Tuesday morning to you. Hope everybody's well and happy this morning. Hope you've got your your right foot on the ground this morning. That you're up and about through the grace of God and being thankful for it. We're a blessed people and we don't even know it. Good morning, Kayla. Hope you're well and happy this morning. Hope you and Archie are doing well this morning. Hope everybody's doing well this morning. I'm going to do a song called The Judgment. Powerful little song here, and it's a little different, but it's it took me a minute or two to learn it. It's a beautiful song. Just listen to the words of the song. All is still, heaven is silent, as the mighty judge ascends the throne. The book of life is open, and countless souls. the throne a voice like thunder depart I know you not for the names written in this book are the souls my blood has bought faces turn as into the court comes the very seed of sin. He who was the saint's accuser must face the charges against him. With the fury of all the ages, that demon voice begins to cry. It's not fair, I almost have From the throne comes the verdict, the lake of fire will be your home. And I see every knee is bowing, every hand in honor raised, every voice to him is lifted, thou art worthy. Standing in attention as redeemed they begin to sing. Heaven's chorus resounding anthem. You're our Savior, the Lord and King. And I see every knee is bowing, every hand in honor raised, every voice to Him is lifted. Thou art worthy, the Lamb be praised. Thou art worthy, the Lamb be day's coming. That day's coming. It's not going to be long either. It's not going to be long until 
we're there before that throne and it's gonna you're gonna hear one of two things it's either gonna be enter in my good and faithful servant or it's gonna be depart I know you not where do you stand today if that day were today what would your verdict be what would you hear the Lord say to you my prayer is that it would be enter in my good and faithful servant because I'm doing my best to be that good and faithful servant so I hear those words I can only answer for me I can't answer for you you'll have to answer for yourself where do you stand where do you stand if, the, if today was the day if today was that day and you had to stand before your Lord and say, say what you had to say to give your account of your life to present yourself where do you stand where do you stand with the Lord today if you come before the judgment throne today where would your eternity be honestly answer that question today I always say here's you something to think about today well here's an, here's something that you need to honestly answer today today's the day of salvation if you cannot know within a shadow of a doubt knowing inside of your heart and soul that you're going to hear those words enter in my good and faithful servant if you've got any doubt in your mind that you're not going to enter in hear the words enter in my good and faithful servant change is all it takes turn around and walk towards jesus because if you're not uh, walking toward him, you're walking away from him. If you're not following him, you're getting further and further away from him. Choose you this day who you will serve. Today is the day of salvation. And as you think about that, remember, the good Lord gave you another opportunity for a reason. He gave you another opportunity for one reason. Because he loves you. He loved you so much that he sent his only begotten son to die on a cross to give you the opportunity to live forever. What you do with your opportunities is up to you. How you live your life is up to you. Can't nobody make you. Can't nobody else answer for you but you. So today, make up your mind. Before the judgment gets here, before the judgment's there and it's too late, before you have to hear those words, depart, I know you not. Those are the saddest words in this English language, in any language, depart, I know you not. That's five words that nobody wants to hear. Nobody wants to hear those five words, depart, I know you not. When it's so easy and so simple, to just invite him into your heart, serve him with every ounce of your being, walk in his light, shine his light for him. Let him shine through you. Let Jesus live through you. Let people see that he is alive through you. And in the all in the end, it'll be enter in, my good and faithful servant, and you'll enter into rewards you have no imagine, no imagination for. None whatsoever. God's got so much in store for his children. I mean, you look at the beauty that he gave us here on this earth, and heaven's going to be better than this. You know, it's sad. If you're lost, this is as close to heaven as you're ever going to see. You die lost, and this is as close to heaven as you'll ever get. But there's a flip side to that coin. If you're a child of God... This is as close to hell as we'll ever have to worry about being. I'm glad. I'm thankful. I praise the Lord that I opened my eyes and turned myself to, to him and give myself to him. That I can walk in his light. That I can be a reflection for his love. It's the only way, people. He's the way, the truth, and the life. I pray that you make the right choices today.
because that's life choices. Life are all around us, choices, choices, choices. Best choice you can make, give it all to God. Let Him, let Him, let go and let God. Let God be, let God be in control. Just give it all to Him. Things will be a whole lot better. I ain't going to say they're going to be easy. Because we go through trials and tribulations like everybody else. The only thing is we already know the outcome of them before they even start. We know that we have victory in Jesus. Guys, have a great day. I love you and all. I hope everyone has a blessed day. We'll talk soon.